Welcome to MMA Nit, and here's 5 things you might not know about UFC 229. So, UFC 229 takes place in the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, the fight capital of the world. This will be the 118th UFC event hosted in Las Vegas, and the 12th taking place at the T-Mobile Arena. Injuries ahead of events are fairly common, but so far not a single fighter has pulled out of UFC 229 due to injury. However, Sean O'Malley was pulled from the card following a still undisclosed USADA violation. UFC 229 will feature the lightweight champion Khabib Nurmagomedov taking on former lightweight champion Conor McGregor, while another former lightweight champion Tony Ferguson takes on yet another former lightweight champion Anthony Pettis in the co-main event. However, between all these four fighters, only a single title defense has been made. Khabib Nurmagomedov is well known for his impressive win streak, but he and Tony Ferguson are actually tied at third place for longest active win streak in the UFC with 10 straight UFC wins each. The previous record for the biggest UFC pay-per-view was UFC 100 for over 1.6 million pay-per-view purchases, which was beaten by UFC 202 McGregor vs Diaz with 1.65 million pay-per-view purchases. However, these records may very well be completely shattered as UFC President Dana White has predicted over 3 million pay-per-view buys, which, if it now happens, will be almost double the previous record. However, it remains to be seen if UFC 229 can do as well as White has predicted. So those were 5 things you might not know about UFC 229. This is MMA News, we'll catch you guys next time.